What's up guys? Today's time for System Test 22 and today we're going to be taking a look at a mixture of an old simplex system and a new simplex system and some sort of firelight thing I put up here. I don't know what it is. Anyways, but the old uh, simplex system part of it was requested on my last system test by New Age Connor Alarm Extra. So if you have any requests for me to do anything else in my system test videos, please leave them in the comments and most likely I'll take a look at it the next system test. So anyways, uh, let's get started. So first off for our simplex firelight thing or whatever the heck I called it, uh, we have two simplex horns. On the right we have the old simplex horns, the simplex 2901-9845 and that is set on code 3. And then on the right we have a simplex uh, 4901-9820 I believe. It's a true alert remote horn and that is also set on code 3. For the pole stations we have these two firelight poles. They're both uh, firelight BG12 SLs. They're the single action version of the BG12 series. The one that's on the right side, so in the second pole station spot, the spring clip in that one is actually broken. Um, and so I got the one on the left side as a replacement for it. But for now, it does work well enough. I'm not sure how long it'll last, but I figure before it breaks, I might as well put it into a system test video. And of course, for the panels, we have a Siemens SXL EX right there in the middle running the fire alarm system. Off to the left of that, we have a DMP XR500 running the security system portion. And then way off to the right, we have the Ansel Auto Pulse 2000 running the Halon system, but we're not going to be using that today. So, we'll go ahead and get started with the Firelight Pull Station on the left. So now we'll go ahead and try the broken station. The problem with this station is in this little clip right here. It's broken off on this side. Right here. But it works well enough for now. So my question as we get towards the end of this video is, for those of you who are viewers who watch my videos regularly, does it really do you any good to see me reset this security system every time? Um, I usually like to include all the steps in case somebody watches my videos for the first time and wants to see what goes on, but if it gets old to have me put this thing in here every time, just let me know. So uh, on that note, thank you guys for watching. 